So, this is in continuation of our topic about arithmetic sequence. So, in an arithmetic sequence, the terms between any two terms are called arithmetic means. So, from the word itself, between. So, these numbers or these terms are in between two terms. Example, in an arithmetic sequence, insert three arithmetic means between 18 and 30. So, the common difference here is a known. So, we are going to solve for D or the common difference by applying the formula for arithmetic sequence. A sub n is equal to A sub 1 plus quantity n minus 1 times D. Now, we have these values or these given for this equation. We have or we will set 18 as our first term. So therefore, a sub 1 is equal to 18. And then, our n is 5. Since we have two given terms, and we are going to insert three more terms, so there are five number of terms in a given sequence. And then, our a sub 5 is equal to 30. Okay? Now, in this, a sub 5 is equal to 30, that is equal to 18, our first term, plus n, which is equal to 5, minus 1 times d. So the same thing, we have to simplify. 30 minus 18, transpose positive 18, it will become negative. Then distribute d to 5 and negative 1. 5 times d is 5d, and negative 1 times d is negative d or negative 1d simplify further we have 30 minus 18 is okay 30 minus 18 is 12 and then 5d minus d is 4d then to solve for d we have to uh, divide both sides of the equation by 4 making 12 divided by 4 is equal to 3 so since our first term is 18 we have to add it with 3, the common difference. So, 18 plus 3 is equal to 21. Next, 21 plus 3 is 24. 24 plus 3 is 27. And 27 plus 3 is 30. So, the three arithmetic means between 18 and 30 is 21, 24, and 27. So, take note that the arithmetic mean or the average of the number say x and y given by this formula so the arithmetic mean x is equal to the sum of the two numbers divided by 2 we have x plus y over 2 meaning we have to add the two numbers and divide it by 2 since there are two numbers involved now for the arithmetic mean or average of a set of numbers say x sub 1, x sub 2, x sub 3, until x sub n, that is given by the formula x sub 1 plus x sub 2 plus x sub 3 until, and so on, plus x sub 1, all over n. So meaning that is equal to the summation of x's all over n. So if there are 10 numbers or 10 terms, then you have to divide that one by 10 also. Okay, let us have an example. Find the arithmetic mean between 8 and 20. So, take a look at the given sentence example. All you have to do is to find an arithmetic mean, only one, between 8 and 20. No need to insert three arithmetic means, no? With regards to our previous example, no need to do that one. Just find the arithmetic mean. So, we have this formula. Just going to add the two given terms and then divide it by 2. So we have 8 plus 20 is 28 divided by 2 is 14. So we can have this sequence 8 and then followed by 14 and 20. Because 14 is the arithmetic mean between 8 and 20. Okay, so we will have another example. Find the arithmetic mean between negative 5 and 7. So the same thing, we are going to add negative 5 and 7, resulting to positive 
2 divided with 2, x is equal to 1. And then, if you're going to insert now, to make it a sequence, we have negative 5 followed by 1 and then 7. So we have now this sequence. And then the arithmetic mean, of course, between negative 5 and 7 is 1.